What's up guys, Jay, I'm here. Welcome to Attic Fitness Journey. Back in the facility. Here we go. Shoulders tight today since kahapon back. And same goes, hitting that front belt in any way we can. Tsaka yung way na feel natin talaga na solid dito. Which is yung close grip bench pero variation siya. So kapag nakatayo, parang palayo yung push niya. Pag, di ba ang close grip? Pag ganyan. Ang ginagawa ko, pag ganun. So, pag nakahiga, mahirap siya i... Uh, sa, sa nakatayo ako, sipin nyo na lang nakagalan ako. So, pag nakahiga tayo, di ba? Ganyan tayo mag press ng close grip. Yeah, close grip for our triceps and a little bit of chest. Pero ako sa rin, i-hit yung front delt talaga. Palayo. Pag ganun, pa-diagonal. So, ito yung higa na part. Ito yung pantay, pa-bench press. Ito yung close grip tricep. Close grip bench press. Ito naman yung, for me ha, talaga tiyatamaan yung front delt, focus. Na little bit of flaring out na elbows flare out, tas palay pa ganun. Munta sa uh, husod. So, pa ganun. So, yun yung maximize natin today for our front delts. Same old, hitting it with intensity. Medyo may hingyan, so kapon umuulan-ulan. Ngayon, mas pakawisan tayo. So, heavy shoulder pressing for the first part. Tapos, races. Then, yeah. Races, yun na yung front delt, side delt, rear delt. I'm gonna take you guys along with it na lang. Then, I'm a voice over it for workout for ating uh, shoulders. I-incorporate ko pala natin yung upright row since medyo naninigli ko siya pag nag-shoulders. Since nakukot up na ako sa mga races. So, siguro, each change ko na muna yung behind the neck press. Since medyo narabdo mo ko siya sa triceps eh. So, kailangan ko pa practicein ng solid. Pero switch things around natin yung behind the neck tsaka upright row para at the short amount of time ma-hit natin madami and my intensity. So yun, kakainom ko lang ng ating substitute pre-workout. Pero hindi lahat, hanggang dito lang. So, 3 days na to. Para hindi masyado marami sa calories. Sayang eh, 50 calories din yun. 150 to isang pote. Though, syempre may mga extra calories ako na hiniinom. Ang almusal kanina slash lunch brunch ay white rice tapos chicken breast. 150, ka, 150 grams ng chicken breast tsaka siguro mga 150 grams din ng ano yun, ng white rice to 200 grams na galaro doon. Kasi na-eyeball ko lang. So, yun ang ating breakfast. May bear brand na 0.5 sachet coffee tapos aros kaldo. Kunti lang yung aros kaldo, parang siguro tatlong tablespoon lang na may chicken breast din. Tapos yun. Yun yung mga mo extra sugar na uh, kinakain ko. Pero mga miscellaneous lang naman, mga maliliit lang. Pero be mindful kasi pag nag-add up yun, yun baka magiging detriment sa ating uh, caloric deficit. Tapos nagsaging pala. Track nyo na lang as much as you can. And then, yeah. Pati nyo na iniisip. Pag tinatrack nyo na, pag nakatype na, pati nyo na isipin. Tapos tingin nyo sa gabi kung kaya pa kumain or hindi na. Katulad kahapon, sobrang hirap sa yung taas ng cravings ko kagabi. Since mahaba yung kinardio natin. Or usual na cardio session, pero wala rin kasi akong rest day ng cardio. So kagabi, gusto ko pang kumain ng mas madami. And isa rin siguro ng factor yun kasi nawalan nga tayo ng protein shake. So yung space na for protein shake na calories natin na within 2,000 calories, napapalitan ng carbs. Just tinapay, yun yung medyo uh, gusto ko pa kumain. Pag kumain ka ng konting tinapay, gusto mo laging kumakain. <laughs> so yun, napapalitan siya ng ibang calories. Which is, mahirap sa ating body composition. Since maganda sa body composition talaga is high protein, moderate carbs, saka low fat. For me ah, yun yung pinaka-effective sa akin. 
since yung cravings mabawasan since kama na kapusog talaga yung protein so hopefully in due time may blessing yun dumating uh, mga nakain ng income or a budget for protein shake so ilang cara pre workout usual stuff natin tutun dante struggle dante nung before new year kaya nagarap din ako ng budget for protein shake cara pre workout and ngayon next year na magjujun na yun 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 So ang ginagawa ko pag wala na, wala na akong space for calories na hit ko na. Minum na lang ako, ako maraming tubig. Tapos kung meron pang cravings, toothbrush. Tapos kung meron pa ulit cravings, bago matulog. Yung kukuha ko ulit na toothpaste, nalagay ko sa dila ako. Kasi parang meron sa... Basta parang may sign sa brain natin na for me ah, na pag may mental na sa bibig, parang may toothbrush na time to sleep nawawala yung uh, cravings. Try nyo lang din, baka effective sa inyo. Yun. Toothbrush lang <laughs> yun. Tapos mumug kayo. So, yun. At least na overcome natin yun. Kasi kaya kong kumain talaga ng madami. In one sitting. Siguro big, big eater ako, lagi akong gutom. Kahit naman di akong ka-diet, lagi akong gutom. <laughs> Kasi sa nakakatulong talaga yung maging ma-quantify yung calories natin through tracking. My fitness pal, turo, naturo ko na na little bit dun sa previous video na pinyo na lang. Tsaka, yun, subscribe para maka eh, makita nyo yung day-to-day -day natin. Workouts, kain, and then journey. So, yun. Pag-sover ko na lang. Shoulders, let's go! What's up, guys? Full shoulder workout here. Making a point na mag-stretch na Every time we work out, tayo since medyo we're paying huge price dahil medyo masakit sakit na yung mga body parts natin since parang warm up ko na yung lakad inisip ko pero mahalaga rin talaga na nagsa stretching doing some dynamic stretching before workout then making sure na uh, medyo na hit yung mga muscles na small and fully warmed up before hitting those weights so coming soon ang full stretching stretching routine natin and just wait for that be sure to subscribe comment down below kung may mga kayo makita and here we started out with our barbell press superset with uh, dumbbell pressing since Kaya ko siyang i-superset since medyo mabigat yung kaya ko sa dumbbell press since yung mga gym videos natin previously mga 3 months ago mabigat talaga ka mag a shoulder press though hirap tayo sa ano, mind muscle connection kaya after nito nung standing military press nag dumbbell press tayo superset since kaya naman natin yung load and konti lang yung plates ko to parang hit or to exhaust my shoulder muscles so medyo limited lang tayo kaya maganda ay superset nyo na lang kung medyo kulang ko lang yung plates nyo since lockdown pa rin naman tayo hindi pa rin nabubukas yung mga gyms and yeah so as ano lang uh, beating the summer heat then the next one is hitting the front delt um, tricep yung ginawa ko dito yan single arm alternating pala na front raises tapos by the end of it yung both arms just to increase that intensity then the next set is shoulder press pero power grip yung uh, yung stance natin then slow and controlled make sure na you're hitting your front delt since medyo nahirap pa tayo sa mind muscle connection parang nito take over yung mid delt ko which is all good pero yun practice natin na 
uh, tamaan yung front delt natin which is talagang uh, nai-hit nitong exercise na to para siyang yung seesaw push ups so parang ganun yung katumbas yung feeling so talagang tinatamaan yung front delt natin to may kasamang tricep of course and then konting chest pero nito masarap squeeze talaga yung front delt mo since perfect yung angle eh make sure na find the weight na controller try nyo lang guys kung medyo mahina yung front delt nyo katulad ko or medyo rare case kasi ako usually kasi ang mahina sa shoulders is yung side delt tsaka rear delt pero ako front tsaka uh, rear delt yung aking weakness eh so try nyo lang din guys you might get something out of it and the next um, natin nagmumon tayo sa mid delt na so heavy workload since kaya natin magbig magbigat sa ganitong exercise which is yung upright row make sure na hindi masyadong nag shake shake yung ano nag parang may headbang headbang yung katawan nyo make sure na medyo fix imagine nyo nasa smith machine kayo so straight up and down lang yung path nung ating barbells and then after that we moved on syempre sa classic natin para reverse pec fly na lower yung lower chest yung hinihit pero reverse so hihit natin yung back part of the mid delt and leaning forward uh, pinkies up tapos punta sa likod yung ating uh, path nung arms then super set with normal na lateral raise and medyo gumaganda na yung mind muscle connection ko dito since for the longest time na nag-grudge workouts tayo yan, light lang yung weight na ginagamit ko 10 pounds siguro mas siguro 3 pounds yung ano samang handle tsaka yung lock you know after nun, doing partial reps 10 reps and then sa huli meron tayo yan hold nyo for as long as you can kung kaya nyo mga 3 seconds uh, para lang ma-increase yung intensity sayang yung ano, metabolic stress then, doing some flexing having a good music with Spotify since my <laughs> Wi-Fi dito sa church and then we moved on of course rear delt yata na neglect and then naisip ko kasi pag rear delt talaga make, it, make sure na um, lightweight pero nagpapaso ako ng volume para tamaan kasi pag mag heavyweight eh mag heavyweight tayo tutulong na yung rhomboids yung mga back muscles natin so yan neutral grip uh, 10 to 12 reps tapos to um, overhand grip 5 reps then yan kakaibang view yan papunta sa likod yung path nung ating uh, arms Yan, talagang dito tinamaan eh. So, hit nyo lang lahat ng angles. And then, yeah. After nun, nag abs and calves tayo. And then, finish the workout cardio session. So, yun. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Full shoulder workout. Finished. Shoulders, abs, calves. Magka-cardio session na tayo. And then, Let's try to eat healthy. So, siguro mga 80% healthy, 20%. Pwede na. Yun. Yun yung guys updated. Thanks for coming sa aking shoulder workout. Let me know in the comments if you want to see more or may questions pa kayo. And don't forget to subscribe, of course. Jim here. I'm gonna see you tomorrow. No rest day. Let's go.